It's a question that a lot of uh, paleontologists and archaeologists too grapple with is why did we lose so many big animals uh, during this period of uh, climate change and when humans were arriving on different continents and what roles did those two uh, factors play and also uh, what sort of characteristics help a species survive in times of uh, great extinction. This is a, uh, the giant rhino is actually the most stunning beast uh, in the world, actually the, the largest land mammal in the world. Um, that this animal, animal called Indricotherium, um, coming from the Central Asian country of Mongolia, uh, that's excavated by the American Museum Central Asian Expeditions. And these animals is the largest one ever to have walked on land. It actually is several times larger than the elephant itself. So this is a true giant. It's actually also larger than some of the dinosaurs that we know. Well, I think people can learn just how incredibly diverse mammals are and have been through time. And also, I think there's a real opportunity to learn about why we don't have as many extreme mammals around today as we did just a very short period of time ago and to get people thinking about what might have caused this uh, extinction event that culled most of the large mammals from the ecosystem and how we might prevent that from happening again. We're at the Los Angeles County Museum of Natural History and this is an exhibit of extreme mammals on another edition of Out and About with Roger Martin. Thank you.